All right, so here we are for round three. We'll be taking the play and keeping that one. Can't see any reason not to keep this. Um, also can't think of a reason not to just play the Mystic on turn one. So there we have it. We've got an Elf. Let's draw a Dumri. Swamp Thoughtseize. No. All right, sweet. All right, so no Thoughtseize. No Thoughtseize. That means we're gonna we're gonna see we're gonna see some satyrs. And since goats are not good enough, they're the closest thing I got. Half goats. All right. So we're hoping that our elf lives through the turn. It did. And I th think. So what happens if we hold it back? I don't think we're supposed to hold it back. I think we're supposed to get aggressive. Best thing about that is if he has a downfall, he gets to kill it anyway. Uh, but this way, he can attack it for one. And if he makes uh, a rat, I'm okay with that because then we're just going to dragon. Wow. Attacking me. So this is going to die to a downfall. I mean, there's there's no other reason, right? I can't think of any reason that that would happen that way. <clears throat> but I mean, if that's the case, then we just get to make a dragon. I can't see it not being the case. Night Veil Spectre. All right, that's that's a good enough reason. No, I still think we're supposed to dragon and just make a guy. Now what could happen is we could get biobladed, but then we get to attack for a decent amount again the next turn. And we're pretty well set up against, uh, like he can't demon us, so um, you can buy blood or satyrs and kill our Xenagos. Just nothing? That doesn't make much sense to me. Nothing? Nothing. All right, well, I'm just going to... Do I just send with these, or do I send with the elf as well? Because we can always play Manic Influence and Temple next turn. I think I just send with everything. Uh, I'll pass priority. Alright, so there's that. Gore Clan there. Kill off all that, and then we'll just take care of this rat. We'll take care of our rat problem. And we have a pretty dominating board. Yeah. All right. So let's go to the sideboard. We're going to do exactly what we did round one by bringing in the mortars, the harnesses, the bows, the chandras. We're going to take out these pesky flesh bloods and caryatids. We're going to slow down a little bit, but we're going to have just a much uh, superior mid game and hopefully be able to pull ahead that way because, like, they're. Life Banes, their Thought Seizes, their Duresses, they all just make our draws uh, two mana heavy when we're playing so many sources. So right now we got to drop from 31 mana sources down to uh, 27. And even at that, our, our, our Mystics do a lot of work with the bows, um, getting our Planeswalkers into play faster, but the Keratids don't do a lot of that. Um, so 
Mystic's always been fine for me, whereas uh, the characters just, they just dirtle. And since the deck has Matic Confluence, I'm able to take out the Keratids and not have to, and not have to rely so hard on them for the extra mana. So, there's that. Uh, but uh, all in all, I'm, I'm very happy with how this uh, boards. Uh, on the draw is, is pretty rough, I'm not going to lie. Like, I think Mono Black is one of our more difficult matchups. Especially if he keeps in Bioblight, because we keep drawing Double Elf. Don't have Dutsies! Alright, so, uh, depending on what he takes, it's probably going to be Xenagos, uh, and then he's going to lifebane away the Polokranos. Alright, that is the worst draw in our deck, I think, because at least if it's red, it can cast uh, a Chandra if we top deck it, or a Dragon, but we are kind of a... Uh, a little light on red sources. Alright. I can get behind playing both our guys. I'm just playing Temple next turn. So this way, if he life banes us, we can just attack with all of our guys. Trade with ooze. Yep. We get we at least get four damage in that way. All right. Well, now that's not going to be the case because we drew another Poconos. And since we drew Poconos, I want to keep the ooze around. Especially if he draws Demon. We can get a two for one out of him, at least. Never works that way ever, but it, it might this game. All right, so he's just extending. Interesting, 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 interesting. So this is very interesting. Extremely interesting. <laughs> Alright, I'm just going to attack with Polokranos and... I, mean, I just, I don't agree with his play at all. He should have just done that. So now I just get the two for one, and we get all the value back that we lost with the life bane, as well as a, a somewhat plumpy. I mean, I guess he saved some. No, I mean he didn't, because he would have just traded with something. All right, let's look at the top. I'm okay with that on top. I mean, if he has a demon, that kind of sucks. Again, we're in that same position we were in round one, where we might have to get two for one. Do not kill my scam juice. No! It would have been so juicy. Alright, we'll take a dragon. Can't cast a dragon, but we'll take it. And now, no demon, no demon, no demon. Because if that happens, we just have to fight. We have to fight with our immutable. <laughs> like, there's no way around it. We're just... Awesome. So just removal spells that are not Heroes Downfall. No! So, dark creature fights. I'm sorry, Mutafault. <laughs> it wasn't a fair fight. I should have mortars first, so we could have at least dealt with him. All right, another demon, and, and, and we can just back it up. All right, I'll fight at Connections. That's not a demon. That's still not good for us, but it is not a demon. I wish there was a land, though. We need him to start flooding out. 
Uh, just like we're flooding out. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, this is not good. We're, we're down a Domri. Oh no. Oh no, heavens no. We are not equipped to beat that. Yeah, we're dead. We're not coming back. Packrat just gets out of control and we're not even close to casting anything reliable. But at least we got the play back. And beat on the play is so sweet. Alright, so we're gonna keep this configuration and go to battle and yeah the deck is a little light on creatures for Domri but it uh, it's still okay I'm gonna keep this hand uh, it's not the strongest in the world but uh, I hate um, mulliganing anything that's even remotely close to playable against a deck with Thoughtseize and Duress Especially when we're on the play, like we're just not gonna have enough resources to win the game. And he kept Bioblades in, that's worth noting, so we're not gonna want to play the second scavenger news. But yeah, I don't know why he kept it in. It kinda sucks that he did. Alright, so land. Alright, so we are gonna play a second one. And we're gonna get stuck on lands. Mm. At least we have a lot of life. Look at all that life. That's so many life points. It's so many. Uh, we're going to die to this demon he casts next turn, but we do have 24 life. Play a demon, kill everything. Oh, thank God. Nope. Second main phase demon. I always, I always make sure he does it right. Perfect! Perfect card on top. Yes. Couldn't be better. Uh, not going to get that one. That one was a little rough. Uh, yep. All right. We'll see if we win six packs next round.